Edgar, come and test out my shotgun for me. Thank you. Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days to Die Alpha 21. I'm an old guy. Coming in, this is the Apocalypse Ranger series. And we are getting ready to go on our next Tier 5. Um, but uh, just be uh, before we do that, I just wanted to kind of show you a couple things around the base. Um, I put a gate in here. I've cleaned up, pretty much cleaned the entire place up. So all of the big grass has been removed. I've gone around and cleaned up all of the trash pretty much on the entire property uh, and have also cleaned up all the trash and majorly broken stuff in, uh, you know, here in the main building as well. I haven't actually removed that safe yet. And uh, yeah, so it's coming along. The next step for this place, of course, is going to be repairing. Um, so we'll be working on that. Here, let me check these waters here. Oh, I must have just emptied those before I logged out the last time. Got to get that door fixed. And um, yeah, so the whole place is clean. Now the next step, like I said, is just to start working on getting things repaired. Uh, okay, so let's go ahead and get ready for this next uh, tier five we're gonna do. So uh, we got large medi kits there. Um, I, I had some fort bites. I don't know what the heck I did with them. I must have left some stuff back at the original base because I can't find the darn things. So, yeah, I'm not sure where those are at. I'd like to actually get some more of those at some point. Uh, even though they do make you, you know, uh, th really thirsty. But So, okay, so we have four tuna fishes and two chili dogs in here. So I think that's probably adequate for food. And we have a full thing of red tea. Why don't we take one of these red teas right now, though, just as a topper. And I think we're good on food. Let's go in here and what do I have in the bike? Okay, so I got some meds in the bike. So we're in pretty good shape on that stuff too. Out of junkies, we got eye candy for the end loot. Okay, so that looks good. Um, let's go ahead and load up on ammunition then. So I have actually placed a bunch of my extra 7.62s, 44s, shotgun shells, etc. And here we got that um, dart trap bundle in uh, the last uh, the last episode. So that stuff's all sitting there. We'll, we might do something with that, you know, for a horde base. Um, but let's go ahead and take... Uh, I think we'll, we're fine with one stack of magnums. Um, but it's the, it's the 9 mils that we use the most. So let's take a bunch of those... Uh, we only use the armor piercing and the pistol for the moment. Oh, incidentally, if you did watch the last episode, or even if you didn't, uh, we found this purple 9mm right here. Oh, and we also found this auto shotgun, too. In fact, you know what? We need to look at that. I didn't look at that one. Uh, and we found this awesome M60, but I'm not spec at all in a machine gun, so we're going to just sit on this for, for now. Uh, but anyway, what I was saying is that this purple pistol is 5.1 points inferior to the blue pistol in terms of its actual damage and actually its range too and even you know with mods putting mods on here because this can hold one more mod slot it still doesn't it still isn't better than this one um so just to show you that um let's grab i don't know maybe this laser sight uh so if we take the three mods off of here See, if we just compare them base now, you can see that the blue pistol has 6 more range and 5.1 more range damage, right? And if we modify this and put all four of those mods on there, that's 51.2. And, oh, now, now it is... I've, hmm, I've run into this before where... So, okay, look at this. Watch this. So if, if I go, so I have this pistol selected, and then I go click on this one. You see how it says, it says 46. It says 46 until I move, and, but as soon as I move my cursor, or move it off it, then it updates. That is really weird. Okay, so the purple pistol 
has an actual 60.9 ranged damage. Um, it does have really poor range, though. Effective range of 11. What's reducing that? I wouldn't think any of these would reduce the range. Okay, so 60.9. But you see what I'm saying, though? What I did was I flipped it over. I moved the mouse, the cursor over to it, and I didn't move the cursor, and it still it makes it look like... Yeah, right here. It makes it look like it's still inferior, so it doesn't register the mods until you move the cursor off of it. Very interesting. Okay, let's do this. Let's take the mods all the way off and put the back on or put them back on here uh this one and this one so this has an effective 64.1 and that was a 60 something this has a range of 15 this has a range of 17. so it still seems like the blue pistol's overall better uh in its modded state yeah 60.9 and less range. So the, the the blue pistol, even with an extra mod on here, nope, it's still 60.9. Okay, so even in spite of that little weird kind of, like, I don't know if you'd call it a bug or not, but that weird glitch, the blue pistol is still the superior pistol. Okay, well, I guess that what that means, well, we'll keep the, the purple one as a backup anyways, but it, the good, I guess the good thing about that is we could sell the purple one then and you know, make more money than we would selling the blue one. Okay, let's take a look at this shotgun. Um, I've got I've got a duck bill here. We got a laser sight. We got a tube, and uh, and a light. I don't know if it'll let me do the laser sight and the light. So let's go ahead and modify this. Okay, so. I'd rather, well, no, I don't need a laser sight on a shotgun, for goodness sakes. But you can't put that on there, because this one uses the drum mod, that's why. I don't think I can make that yet, can I? Or can I? Drum, nope. We don't know how to make the drum magazine mod. Can We can make the extended magazine, though, I think. Well, I mean, can that fit on there, I guess is what I'm trying to say. That's right, you can put that on there. Okay, good. Um, so can I take the extended magazine off of here and put it on here? I can. Okay, great. Let's grab... Because I want to put that other one back on... Wait a minute, where the hell are all my iron ingots? Do I not have... I've got to have iron ingots somewhere. Oh, right here. Okay. I don't have very many. I'm going to have to make some more of those. I've just been cranking out the steel as well. Um, all right. We can do the diamond tip too, but we'll do that later. That's a mining thing. Okay. We need glue, uh, mechanicals, and springs. All right. So let's make another one of these. I have a few more armor piercings in there. Okay. Now, how does, how does the damage between these two compare? Okay, the auto shotgun actually does more damage than the green pump. Because, you know, you can't just assume that nowadays with... After I just demonstrated that the purple pistol is actually inferior. Okay, um... You know what, though? I think I'd rather have the crippler mod on here instead of the light. So we don't need the light, really. We can put it on here just for the hell of it. And let's take the blue die off and put that on here too. Okay, we'll just keep this other shotgun as a backup. Beautiful. Okay, we have one hell of a badass auto shotgun here, you guys. Um, I need my repair kits. Two, two, two parts. 
Let's repair that. We could pr probably wait a little bit longer on that one before we repair it. And then we'll put this one back on our pistol. Make sure everybody's loaded. Fan freaking tastic. Okay. We got a full stack of nades. We got food. We got drink. Our meds. We got meds in the uh, in the bike. How the hell did you get in here? Oh, she, <laughs> she busted the gate. Damn it, Jim. Oh, we got four skill points too. My goodness. That's right. We got a bunch of skill points from the last tier five we did. Just forgot about that. So we need to look at that too. Okay. I'll see you guys over at, well, where the, where are we going? We're going to Vanity Tower. I have never uh, done this POI. I've never been in this POI. I've never watched anybody else do it. So this is going to be a brand spanking new experience for all of us. Well, for me anyway, some of you guys who are watching this have possibly done it or seen the other people do it, but I have not myself. So looking forward to it. I'll see you guys over there. All right, we're here. Edgar, come and test out my shotgun for me. Thank you. That's very kind of you. You too, Skater Punk. Anybody else? Oh, that's Harley Quinn over there. I think she's considered a bandit. Hey! Damn! She's tough! <laughs> okay, yeah, so she's considered a bandit. We're right next to uh, Rectipoo's place here. All right, so I guess this is an apartment building. Um, it said, because it says last units for sale, or maybe it's condos. It must be condos. Let's do a, uh, a little bit of quick preluding here. Say hello to my little friend. I'm liking this thing. Wow, look at that, you guys. My goodness. That is a nice weapon, even though we're not doing spears. I might just hang on to that just in case we t decide to spec into them at some point. Oh, well, either that or we'll sell it for a shit ton of money. That's really nice. Some more repair kits. All right. So let's go ahead and open this up. We're gonna we're not taking stuff that we that's not super important. I guess I'll hang on to the brass. Um, we'll hang on to those two things for the moment. That's worth 110. Yeah, I guess we'll keep that. Definitely keeping this. Um, all right, so. Since we're going high up in the air, we might want some oh shit drops in our inventory. Most likely we'll be coming back down here multiple times, um, you know, to put stuff in the bike. So, yeah, you know what? I don't... Well, here. Let's take those with us. But I think for the rest of this stuff, we'll just leave it and we'll come down here and get it if we need to. Uh, because there's no way we're going to get through this whole thing without having to come down here a few times to drop stuff off. This is a tier five, baby. Is this door locked? Yeah, it is. Okay. Yeah, these must be condos if they're for sale. I'm just going to loot everything, but I'll toss stuff out later. Uh, yeah, we already know that magazine. Just looking to see if there's any more like mailboxes or anything like that. We could. Hey, chicken. Ch 
check those two things, I suppose. We'll run around here. Vanity Tower. Are those a thing? Nope, they're not. Okay. Uh, we're not going to shovel, be shoveling anything up there. Don't care about that. Don't care about that. We'll keep those. We'll keep those just to make bandages. All of this stuff can go. Okay. Let's do this. Um, this is a clear and... Oh, right. A clear and retrieve. Those are just stones. Okay, let's do this. Are we supposed... Oh, shit. They want us to drop down there to start? What the hell, man? I don't want to do that. Let's get this ready. And here we go. Nobody? Okay. Okay. Hey, why don't we bring the motorcycle down in here? Since we can. That way we don't have to go all the way outside at night time to offload and get ganked by baddies. I see a doghouse down here. That's never a good sign. This is a closing soon. We got a big mo oh shit. Alright, come to Papa. Hurry up. Beautiful. Okay. Uh we gotta do points, don't we? Let's take a look at this. Perception. We are currently at level 7. We wanted to get this up to 8 to get Penetrator and all the way up to get Maximum Demolitions. Um, intellect. What were we working on here? We wanted to get Advanced Engineering and Grease Monkey. Well, we already got Grease Monkey to 4. And on Fortitude... We're going to need some work in the fortitude tree, too. I'm going to start looking at a machine gunner now that we've got that M60, but we're not going to do that tonight. So let's focus on perception tonight. We're going to grab eight so that we can get penetrator four. And I think we will just then keep pumping perception itself. We're going to need an, uh, we, we're going to hang, sit on this point. And we'll just wait and get it all the way to 10 so that we can then get Demolitions Expert all the way up and Dead Eye all the way up. Okay, so that's the plan. Very good. So we have maximum penetration now. And, you know, with these tougher Zekers, uh, that is comes in super, super handy. That's a nice helmet there. It is nighttime. Okay. Is this... That door's locked. Okay, and I'm not seeing a switch, at least on this side, to open it. Oh, magazine? Explosives. Nice. I want to... I really want to start getting into making, you know, the, the better landmines. So... We, we can't quite make the hubcap landmine yet, but we're getting there. Have some buckshot. Have some more buckshot. Do we have a spider too? Yep. All 
Uh, you know what? Let's look at strength for a second. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Okay, we got strength up to an effective eight. But we'll have to get it all the way to ten to get maximum boomstick. But boomstick four is still pretty damn good. Uh, as I've already demonstrated here. That door's locked. Hmm. Okay, if that door's locked, where else do we go? Can't open that. We've got a bunch of um, outside Zeeks wanting to come and play with us. Of course, I'm not really being very stealthy at the moment, but I'm just kind of enjoying my auto shotgun. Auto shotgun and stealth do not go in the same sentence. Okay, where the hell? Oh, here we go. Here we go. That's the way. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Oh, shit. Okay. Whoops. Oh, man. Get in there. There we go. Okay. I wanted to get into a place where I could funnel them. Okay, we certainly got the attention of a lot of other zombos. Okay, let's go this way. How's my healing factor? That's fortitude. All right, we got it up to three, so one health every 15 seconds. That's not too bad. Somebody just got blown up. Can't loot that. Can't loot that. Can loot that. Scrap that. Scrap that. Throw those out. Well, let's keep the paper in case we come across those, um, you know, big paper pallets. Already looked at that, right? Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Oh, shit. It's just two. Oh, man, I love this shotgun. <laughs> it is amazing. Is there supposed to be a thing back here? Yeah. There is a thing back here. Okay. All right. Let's go up here. Search industrial washing machine untouched. You know what? Why don't we break this so Zombos can't just run up here with impunity? Okay. Some green dye. There's that door. That is not a uh, working vending machine. We have 65 out of 75 for the crafting stations. I hear a fire trap. Okay, let's start being a little stealthy. We had our fun with the shotgun. Now it's time to go stealth. The door is not closable. I guess we'll probably get around to him later, maybe. Oh, well, 
we're supposed to go in there. I don't see a valve here, so we're going to have to trace that. That is a long ways up. And they don't want us to use that ladder, apparently. Looks like we have some parkour in our future. Okay, so... Oh, I guess we go up this way. Oh shit! Dude! You must have gotten the fire trap. Sucks to be you. There we go. Didn't I just kill you? I have a feeling bad things are going to happen in a minute. That door's locked. It's one of our paper pallets. Man, I love doing these new POIs that you're not, not familiar with, you know, because it's a brand new experience. Popping pills. This place has ambush written all over it. Okay, that door's unlocked. That's the server room. 63 out of 75 for maxing out medical. We're getting there. <laughs> Toilet paper. It's kind of a cool little design there. Alright, there's some trouble over that way. We can get a headshot off on her. Well, except for... Right, let's run back this way. We're not dealing with a million, just 999,000. So we can handle this. Line up those heads. Okay, let's try this. Whew. Wow. <laughs> Just about extended the entire extended magazine. <coughs> okay, that hurt. Uh, we got ourselves a concussion and an infection, so we're going to have to get down to the bike to fix that. All right, what do we got in here? Uh, oh, yeah, we'll take all that. Okay. So hopefully that is everybody in the lobby down here. I think we should repair this. It's getting close enough to where it's warranted. Harvesting tools. Okay, we're 
we're all hanging out in this hallway here. Those doors are all locked. Big old luggage rack. Okay, we'll take all that. This is a spiral stairwell that doesn't go all the way up, just part way up. There's a valve, but it's not usable. All the zombies I'm hearing, I think, are outside. Got that door partially broke open. there we got a syringe let's scrap this let's turn this into a bandage okay I think I'm gonna break this door uh, so we can get down back down to the bike it'll be a, a quick way for us to get back down there I'm just going to let those outside zombies beat on that door. So we left off over... We didn't go in this room. This is like a, the security room or the server room. And gun's nice. We can now make SMG quality 4. One more level on that, then we'll actually be able to make a better SMG than what we're wearing. Or equipping, I should say. Nothing in here. Well, presumably. As we know, uh, blue items are not automatically better than green items. Okay, so I think what we do now is we we turn that valve off that was up here. That door's locked, so I think we go down and through that little tunnel thing where the flame was. That door's... Yeah, so we go through here. Well, okay, maybe we don't go through here. That was just to get to that loot. Hmm. Does this break easy? Yeah, I, I don't think we we're supposed to go this way to advance. I think we were just supposed to go that way to get to the loot. We've already been through here. That door's locked. Um. All right, so where do I go? What am I missing? What am I missing, man? You know, as always, especially the first time... We're doing a, a, a new POI. I wanna I wanna follow the right path. But I'm not sure where that path is. It just goes back out that way. Hmm. Oh, this way. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I think we go this way. Is that a zombie fall through the floor on top of your head thing? Nope. 
Yeah, close that door. Here's some books. Nope, don't care about that. Alright, so that's it for that office. Door's locked, so we need to go around this way. That door's locked. No, that that's a different zombie, because I didn't see any red dots up here. Here's our friends. Okay. Okay, that's going to open up to out there. Look at this nice little lounge back here. This is cool. Maybe we'll have to have a uh, a series in the future where we live in Vanity Tower like we did in the Deshong in the last uh, our Undead Legacy series. Okay, let's get ready. Door or closing those doors. You'll see two more red dots. Those are probably buzzards. Okay, that takes care of them. This is really nice out here, man. With the pool and everything. I love it. Absolutely love it. Exercise room. Okay, I think that's it for up here. That door's locked. So we're probably probably go in at the exercise room. Yep. That's where we go. Okay. There's a big mama. I wonder if we can snipe her with this without waking up a bunch of other baddies. No, we can't get quite thread the needle there. What if we stand up? Nope. Okay, let's jump up here. Yeah, I see a bunch of zombos in there, actually. This might be a situation for some grenades. Can I get her from here? They're all waking up.
Okay, we got another point, but I think we need three points to get Perception 9. We have two, so we're just going to keep building up to that. Give me all my crossbow bolts back. Yeah, that was, that was a, a tough spot to get a head snipe. Working vending machine. Very nice. Okay. Um. Don't think we need to get anything out of there for now, though. But it's good to know that it's there. Okay, so we're just on the other side of the lobby now. Door's still locked. Okay, I guess we go this way. Doors open. Okay, up the stairwell here. Not going that way. Side zombies are driving me nuts. Oh yeah, maybe the NPCs will take him out. Okay. Probably in these closets, we're going to get some resistance. Where is my nail gun? Let's make sure that door's fully repaired. Nope. That's worth a little bit of money. Little bastard. Sneaky son of a beach. 65 of 75. Trap crafting, armor, and vehicles. 46 out of 100 for vehicles. That door's locked. Let's close that door. This is the kitchen. That door's locked as well. Okay. Take the mushroom seek. Yes, we need potatoes. That door's locked. There's a business zombie right there. Shot. 
Uh, yeah, that other red dot's not moving. Biker Billy. Dead Biker Billy. I'll grab that stuff, but I'm going to end up throwing it out. Armor. Tier 3 military. Nice. Okay, we've got to watch out for birds. Let's go right over this way for a second. This way. I think we were in there earlier. We couldn't get through there. Oh, hi, guys. Stay down. Oh, shit. Hey, dude, can you go over to the other side and kill out the rest of those Zeeks? They're driving me nuts. That door's locked. That door's locked. That's where it wants us to go. Into another kitchen. All right, before I do that though, What's going on over here? The bird's nest. Just like a little rooftop garden area, I guess. Oh, look at that. It pays to explore. So we were over on that side. It doesn't look like you can get over here, but I'm going to go I want to go check it all the way back around the corner anyways, just in case there's, like, loot there or something we missed. Okay, yeah, we were already in that kitchen. Taking either one of those things. What the hell is that stuff doing in a book pile? Oh, okay. I was going to say, that's not a book pile. It's the cabinet. Let's see two red dots. Oh, yeah. Just a normal Marlene. Give you some Kenneth action. Let's go this way. Okay, we've got a couple red dots. Let's see if we can be sneaky sneak. Oh, it's a snake. Can you believe that? A rattlesnake up in the apartments. Just one. Jiggly. Barrel jiggly. Not 
Nothing behind there. Okay. So that's the kitchen. Here, let's get rid of some stuff we don't need. I'll take the... Yeah, actually, I don't really care about any of that stuff. Two journal books. 67 out of 75. Um, We already have these. And there would be no reason to, to make them again, so we might as well sell that schematic. Someone right behind this door? I can't tell. Okay, before we go in there, uh, we could also get into the kitchen over here. Plus, we need to offload again. So, was this just a one way, one way ride? I think that'll give us corn seed. Except for I didn't bring my shovel with me. We harvest it with an axe, probably. Mm, I don't know if we can or not. For a pick, let's try it. Yep, sure enough, we got a corn seed. Nice. And a potato. And a potato. And two potatoes. <laughs> nice. Potatoes are important. We'll take both of those things. All right. Well, no, let's not do that. Let's just go back this way. Okay. Um, we're going to drop off in the bike. You know what I think I'm going to do is... Let's make some blocks. Fuck off, dude. Um, and we're just going to put blocks in the stairwell. So when we have to come up and down, we just always use the stairwell. And we might as well make the blocks stairs, too, to make it a little smoother. On our sails here, uh, we'll just go with these here. And this is where we left off. Okay, so. Parkour time. That door is locked. Nothing's going to bump our head when we jump over to here. Get on the ladder. Oh, we could actually use this ladder, too, if we just repaired the broken parts. Um, That makes more sense. Yeah, let's do that. There we go. Okay, so this is where we crossed over. And it wants us to go up to here. But. Let's just go ahead and repair this part of the ladder too. Just so it's done. But we won't go up that way. We'll go the proper way. All right, so what are we on the fourth floor now, I think? I think we're on the fourth floor. Door's locked. They don't want anybody going in there. If that's locked, 
probably means there's a zombie in there. Or not. Never mind, I don't know what I'm talking about. That. There's a piano in here. That's cool. I've seen that in other POIs too. Oh, big mama. Nice. There's nothing like the, the crossbow for quiet kills or, or a bow. In that regard, it's the same thing. We're just consuming those for XP. Looks like it does. So before we do that, let's get another red dot. It's a crawler. Yeah, there's probably uh, not any more zombies in here. I don't see red dots. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of that and that. And I actually don't want that either. Okay, let's go around this way. Whoa, that wants to push you off the edge there. All right. We will make sure that doesn't happen. See two red dots. This is a room with a hospital bed in it. Jeez, that's close. I don't have any other way to get around him, though. Per. Can't believe the other nurse didn't wake up. Okay. Nice. Nice. Not nice. Uh, I, I don't have my thingamadoodle with me uh, for harvesting this. We might still get a blood bag. Nope, we didn't. Ooh. Shit! Shit! 